सो हेलो एवरीबडी टूडे इन दिस लेसन आई एल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट जिपमर एम बी बी एस एंट्रेंस एग्जाम एंड एंड ट्राइंग टू सॉल्व ऑल योर डाउट्स दैट यू माइट हैव अबाउट इट सो जिपमर बेसिकली स्टैंड फॉर जवाहर लाल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट मेडिकल एजुकेशन एंड रिसर्च एंड इट्स वन ऑफ द प्रेमियर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ फॉर मेडिकल एजुकेशन इन इंडिया इट्स कॉन्स्टेंटली रैंक इन द टॉप टेन इन द नेशनल रैंकिंग्स और दैट आर कंडक्टेड एवरी ईयर टॉप टेन रैंकिंग्स फॉर मेडिकल कॉलेज इन इंडिया सो इट ऑर्गेनाइज द सीट देर आर अराउंड टू हंड्रेड सीट्स इन द जिपमर इन द जिपमर एग्जामिनेशन सो एंड देर आर वन फिफ्टी इन द जिपमर पुडुचेरी एंड फिफ्टी इन जिपमर कराईकाल सो वॉट इज द एलिजिबिलिटी क्राइटेरिया Indian nationals OCI that are overseas citizens of India and NRIs are eligible you know to apply in this in this MBBS examination and they they must be able to complete 17 years of age in the year of admission basically okay and they must have passed or have are appearing on the 10 plus 2 or equivalent examination with with the subjects physics chemistry biology or biotechnology so they should also have passed physics chemistry and biology and english individually and they should have scored a minimum of 50 portion marks in physics pcb for the general category and 40 portion marks in the sc st obc oph category reserved category so basically You have you need to individually pass phys P C B and English, and the cumulative of those four should of P C B should be minimum of fifty percent and forty percent for the reserved categories. If a person belongs to general O P H or to particularly physically handicapped, he needs to get forty five percent marks. The what are the frequently asked questions? So the number of students is approximately. 1.5 lakhs the forms usually come around mid march and the tentative date of examination is around the first week of june or the end of may the duration of the examination is 150 minutes and there's no age limit for this exam okay and you can apply and have a more detailed overview of the seats on the website jipmer.edu.in so what's the minimum score to qualify or to be eligible to get a selection so for general it's 50% for opa general it's 45% okay and for the sc st obc and oph reserved category it's 40% what's the examination pattern so the examination of the the language of the examination is in english and there are 200 multiple choice questions so you need to take care that there's only 150 minutes and 200 questions so the your speed needs to be pretty fast to keep up with the speed and not miss on any questions so the speed is the key here and it's a computer based online test basically and there's no negative marking in this test so minimum you can do is try to attempt all the 200 questions even if you do not know even a single word about that question go and attempt it because it's there is no negative marking keep that in mind okay so and one mark is given for every correct option correct response basically so this is the marking scheme they the like weightage of physics and chemistry is considerably more than what it was in neat it's like 60 for 60 60 60 for physics chemistry and biology and 10 for logical and quantitative reasoning and 10 for english and comprehension so what's the strategy to crack it um, there's no special strategy basically so you need the way you you know try the way you prepared for neat examination just dwell the like dwell on that um, strategy and read ncert practice a lot of questions do a lot of you know these mock test and test series theek hai if you join a coaching institute it helps it helped me so you can do that 
or you can you know wait for our upcoming videos on an academy try to watch that as well they'll be pretty helpful and there's no need to worry about you know the logical reasoning in english so they are like usually simple questions and no need to you know take extra stress or prepare for them okay and that's it be healthy avoid any extra stress an hour of you know relaxing your mind or even exercising really helps a lot it helped me a lot so that's the thing be healthy don't stress keep calm study hard party harder and relax okay that's the key in every exam in life that's is the key that's guys that's it guys uh for this course that's it for me for this course if you have any other doubts you can leave them in the comment section below i'll be trying to answer it okay and for the upcoming videos i'll be making more strategy based videos in the com- upcoming months about what to do if you are you know if you have 6 months left if you have 2 years left if you have a year left and what is the last ditch stand you can do what is the you know in the last month what to do between the neat examination and the aims examination so that is that's it i'll be you know telling you more so that's it for this course keep on yeah i'll keep waiting for my new courses on this strategy and as always thank you for watching and peace out